Guys, Zia Kala on Twitter, it's between Nigerians and South Africans over Miss SA, Miss Nigeria, you know. This started after Chidima got kicked out and now there's a whole lot of controversy on the new Miss SA whether she was deserving, saying that the same situation that happened to Chidima should have happened to the new Miss SA. For continuing, please do me a favor, do not forget to subscribe for more interesting videos on my channel. So guys, Maya Lee Rocks got crowned as a new Miss SA, you know. So this got a lot of people you not know, talking on Twitter and a lot of people really got furious that you know Maya Lee Rocks is not you know originally a South Africans according to what they say, you know. And this girl was really born to South African parents, you know, and I don't understand why they are failing to accept that Chidima, you know, as parents broke the law and she was not deserving to contest in Miss SA. So with Miley Rocks, she was someone who has been in South Africa her whole life, you know. So with Chidima, she only came after the World Cup. First of all, her parents and herself, they lied and said that they came um, to South Africa while she was still a baby. But it doesn't make sense that how the hell is she 23 years old if they came in 20, 2010 FIFA World Cup. So there was just a whole lot of complications and she ended up being investigated and taken out. You know. So a lot of some of the Nigerians were not really happy with the decision of her being you know, taken out of the Miss SA uh, competition. You know. Now with the famous celebrities, some of them commenting saying that um, Miss SA, Miss SA con uh, contestant uh, Chidima you know was done dirty including Burner Boy. Burner Boy commented and said is that why you know she got kicked out you know that's what he was basically saying on his tweet you know because he was laughing and mocking the new Miss SA. The fact that the new Miss SA you know is white and everything people are not really happy with it saying that she's not a true South, a true African and South African are just a whole lot of hypocrites you know they are you know judging someone based on their skin color of which is wrong guys you know we all know that majority of nigerians have been breaking the breaking the law in this country that's why some people are failing to accept that she should have contested contested and it only proved getting getting um getting investigations right you know if it, like guys now I understand that Gaten McKenzie is really influential, you know. This erupted because of Gaten McKenzie. You just got it out of hand because of Gaten McKenzie, you know. His investigations, you know, him leaking out, you know, the papers of Miss SA, you know, really got people, you know, mad. You know, some SA South Africans even apologized, you know. You know, so I just feel like it's really pretty unfair on Maya Lee Rocks. That she won and now she's gonna feel bad that i want miss sa now people are saying no i'm not a true south african whatever so guys they must just accept they must just accept and julius malema is not catching strays also guys <laughs> i don't know julius malema come on bro julius malema did respond to Ch chidima you know but not now he responded when people started uh, throwing attacks on chidima he said that chidima is an african and he feels like there's nothing wrong with her contesting after that julius malema disappeared and never said anything but i'm still i'm still to hear what julius malema is gonna say thank you so much for watching this video guys share thousand comment section below what you think do not forget to subscribe for more interesting videos my channel